question is, how do I add a forum in which students are able to propose one new topic, are allowed to reply to other topics, and will receive an extra credit point for completing the activity? To answer the question, in this video you will see the steps to add a graded forum and configure it to show in the gradebook as an extra credit activity. You can pause this video anytime to complete the activities on your own Moodle page and then continue the video. Log into your course, turn editing on, and navigate to the section into which you want to place the forum. From the Add an Activity drop-down menu, choose Forum. In the name box, type a name for your forum that will appear in the section block. We will type Please Introduce Yourself as the forum name. From the Forum Type drop-down menu, we will choose each person posts one discussion. By the way, if you would like a bit more information on any of the items as you are editing your Moodle page, click on the yellow circle with the black question mark for contextual help. For even more information, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on the link with the yellow circle and the lowercase i for information called Moodle Docs for this page. This link will open a page on the Moodle.org site with information on the activity in which you are working. As we are using Moodle version 2.2, you will see the version number on the top right of the page. Back to your course. In the forum introduction box, you have a chance to write some instructions for the use of the forum. You can choose whether to display this information for users on the front page of the course, but it will show when the students choose the activity. We will take this opportunity to explain the forum process and remind students of the due dates and times by writing. Click on the button below called Add a New Discussion Topic to introduce yourself and tell us why you are taking this course. Please complete your introduction by midnight, Tuesday, June 19th. Before midnight on Friday, June 22nd, please reply to at least two of your classmates. We will not check the box to display description on the course page. We are letting students select their own subscription mode and tracking options so leave the default selections of Optional Subscription and Optional Tracking. There are no attachments required, so we can leave the default size, but change the maximum number of attachments to zero. There is no RSS feed, nor are we limiting the number of times students can post within a time period, so we can leave those selections blank. This is a rated forum. The students will receive one point for completion, so select Maximum Rating as the aggregate type and select 1 for the scale. The students are required to complete the three postings by June 22nd at midnight, so check the box to restrict ratings to items with dates in this range and choose the appropriate dates and times. There are no groups for this activity, so we will leave those settings to the defaults. And we want this information to be visible throughout the course with no conditions, so we will also accept those default settings. We would like students to be able to keep track of their completed activities with checkboxes, so we will leave the default settings to Students can manually mark the activity as completed. As this is extra credit, there are no other requirements for the students, so we can leave the other boxes blank. As always, we must save changes. Choose Save and Display 
to see the activity on the page. We can edit these settings anytime by navigating to the activity, turning on editing, and selecting Edit Settings from the Contextual Settings block. To set this as an extra credit activity, in the Settings block, select Course Administration and click on Grades to open the Gradebook, which will open in the Grader Report view by default. Select the Categories and Items tab and you will see your graded forum activity in the left-hand column. In this demonstration class, there are no categories and only one item. Choose the type of grade aggregation, we will choose Sum of Grades, and then check the box in the Extra Credit column. Note that this box is only available if you use Simple Weighted Mean of Grades, Mean of Grades with Extra Credit, or Sum of Grades. To use Extra Credit with any other type of aggregation, we might want to set up a separate category to calculate the Extra Credit after other calculations have been applied. Now save the changes and go back to the course page to check out the forum. From the Settings block, we can switch our role to the Student view. There is the forum, and when we select it, the instructions are displayed. Thank you.